my success story i i mean this is one of the biggest milestones in my life i have been recently promoted as the manager of my team earlier i was an individual contributor and now i have been very recently promoted as a manager not only that this manager promotion uh, has also come with a very very handsome salary hike so yeah that's one of the biggest milestones and i think yeah thanks to you that is my success right and yeah. how did this happen what was the shift in the mindset what did you really do to be here right so uh, i was always wanting to you know uh, shift from being an individual contributor to a people's person i was always thinking that i will be a better people's manager but internally i was not prepared internally i was very much focused on myself i always had this competitive spirit of you know wanting to do my best and get away with that right competing with my colleagues and i wanted recognition visibility for every small thing that i contributed to the team once upon a time i felt that the entire team is running on me right and uh, in addition i was excessively focused on the problems that the team was facing and i was very fearful to take up those challenges or thinking of rather than thinking of solutions i was very fearful of taking up new challenges and coming up with proactive solutions right and i also started cribbing and complaining about this process not working well my manager not doing this so i went into the cribbing and complaining mode for almost a very long time so nutan ma'am was very patient she used to hear out to me my cribbing every single session that used to go for a good 25 minutes 30 minutes right and then she made me realize that with this kind of mindset with this kind of traits i can nowhere reach or cannot climb the ladder of becoming a people's manager the word itself has people and i only had me myself in that only manager my me manager right so she first made me uh, analyze i went through a lot of self introspection she made me realize that with this kind of mindset i cannot become a people's manager that's where the journey began with the realization right number 2 she then guided me very very meticulously like you know what needs to be done to become a people's manager that is first in shifting the me to becoming a we that took a lot of time because i mean i realized that i was so much within into myself that it took a lot of effort on her part to bring me out of that me point right when the mindset changed from me to we i found a change in myself right rather than you know uh, excessively going into the competitive mode with my colleagues i collaborated i started collaborating i started complementing their work wherever i could pitch in rather than being focused on my own work i started collaborating with my colleagues and that gave rise to our first team recognition and when the first team recognition was given by the leadership i was excessively happy it gave me a lot of happiness and fulfillment that's where i realized that okay this is the beginning like this is the mind shift that when i made like you know from me to you know working with others there was a lot of learnings through the journey from you know when when i worked with my colleagues together so that was the first breakthrough like you know i felt a lot of happiness and this boosted my confidence now i wanted to do more for my colleagues along with my colleagues i wanted to you know achieve the results and uh, this also you know somehow i was able to fight my internal fears that always stopped me from taking new challenges i said no let it let me give it a try let me give it a try i'll do it for it i'll do it for my colleagues i'll do it for my team so when i changed this thought perspective i started becoming more innovative i was able to either come up with solutions or was able to reach out to the right people who can give me solutions earlier i was also resistant to getting you know so i thought that i am okay with it if i am proposing a solution that's fine that's the end of the story but slowly i started no there are people who are better than me in this so when they started proposing solutions and it started working wonders for my team i was extremely excited then came that you know i became this with all this i became outcome driven i wanted to see the desired results for my team right i proactively actively started seeking solutions up with my stakeholders with both internal and external stakeholders and instead of you know blaming this person that person this not being correct that not being correct with the help of newton ma'am we actually lay down a process the first very first time we started you know rather than blaming that this process is not working for my team i started creating the process for our team so with all these changes somehow when i changed from within the changes became external and this caught the attention of my leadership team and I ended up with this promotion so this 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 has been my journey from being a core me to 
you know shifting to a v wow 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 fantastic fantastic thank india. you vidya so i would just like to have three very clear cut what i could see change in mindset one from me to we that was the first thing there was a shift in the mindset that's amazing second it was all about you know believing in yourself because that itself is not that easy and believing in your coach i think that also needs a mindset okay because if you don't have that mindset of believing it becomes very difficult so whatever that she said you believed and you had that mindset to go and implement all those things and that is why i think another reason why you got that results which is extremely important and then third i think the most important thing is uh giving everything giving your all that mindset of i'm going to give everything what i have i think that created this difference so this shift in the three mindset i'm sure this is what is the result shift with that